Hello all my little humans, this is No Pony Special here with another review. And it is My Little Ponies, the movie, Guardians of Harmony, Applejack Pirate. And for today we will be taking a look at the product in the box and showing you all of its little gimmicks that you can play with. It has a little hole here in the side of the box, right here, yay! And we will... Press this down and look, it flaps, it spins, it's a thing you can do, I don't know why they didn't make the battery, that would have been made so much more fun, so much better, it kind, of, it kind of would have been cooler, this looks like it could be a problem, but I don't know, I haven't got a chance to take a look at it really, uh, push and pause, push for soda, and we will take a look at the box real quick and up here we have My Little Pony the Movie! We got Smiling! Now you know the main six. I'll just show, you, show them all to you. And on top we have more of the main six, more of the characters. Applejack with a pirate eye apple. Which I think is pretty cool. I mean that eye patch is really, really sweet on Applejack. I think she's just getting into character. I love her hat. I love that. I love that eye patch that is just cool. We got Applejack, Pirate Pony, and several other languages I cannot pronounce. Guardians of Harmony! Walmart exclusive! Yes, it's a Walmart exclusive! Still don't know why I do it accents, but it's there. Hasbro! Warning! Not for ages... For ages 4 plus, choking hazard, small parts for 3 and under. And we will throw the box. We have a nice little product. Applejack with a sword and that is so cool. I really wish she could have held it in her mouth. That is so much better than the way they're going to have her do it. And your obligatory product shot. She could do this and this and has all this. And you also get this guy. Boy, oh. And he is friend, not foe. Ah, that's the one thing about the My Little Pony series I really don't like. Is that they only release at least one villain in the Guardians of Harmony series. And we have our official My Little Pony sticker. As you can see, it's Princess Twilight. It, not sure if it'll turn, change, but if you can see it, there's also My Little Pony there. It changes between the two. Yay! Uh, and on the bottom is warnings, warnings, etc. And more of that. And again, we get a close up view of Applejack, My Little Pony, the movie, and Guardians of Harmony, and I'm doing it so much wrong. <sighs> <sighs> that is a lot to do. That's a lot to say. Uh, so, why don't we just get into this. First thing we're going to do is come over here and cut the little tape right there. And kids, make sure you have your parents open this because you don't want to cut yourself with a knife. Don't play with knives because they are very, very dangerous. Unless of course they're rubber. Then you can't... Oh, they're dangerous that way. And that's it for the box, so we don't need that. Oh, and we get a nice little scene display. Yay! <gasps> Maybe we can use it. Maybe we can't. I don't know. It's just something that comes with it. This is stuck on there nicely. And don't know why, but there's a, there's a little rubber band thingy here. You can just slip this out without even touching it. I don't know why it's there. It's just there. See? It's not really necessary, is it? That's an accessory. And... Oh, do we have anything in here? Nope. Nothing holding it down. And just... Or maybe I spoke too soon. We have some ties here that are holding it down. You could cut those off if you want. I didn't need to. And we got our little propeller. And next we got Applejack's sword. And let's get your little Applejack out. And that's it for this. Nope. Don't need that. And there we have it. We have it all. Yes. We have some kind of bridle. Is this what we put on her whenever she's... I don't know. <laughs> I think so. Yeah, that, that looks about right. Okay, let's first take a look at Applejack. Well, let's see if her hat comes off. <gasps> oh no, taboo. I took off Applejack's hat. Well, it's not her cowboy hat, so it's fine. 
Her hat has a nice little apple here with a nice big long feather, which is beautifully done. It's all nice and rubbery. In a nice brown and yellowish look. I mean, this is kind of a grayish brown, but I do like it. I do like the design. It's simplistic. It does speak Applejacks in 100% way of ever speaking Applejack. We have <laughs> Applejack here, and we can see underneath her cutie mark. So we won't have to take this off with her to show that off. Right here, she stands up like any other ponies. Her tail is on a ball joint like the others that I have reviewed. If it goes back and forth, you can make her happy. Make her a little doggy 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 white tail. Yay! And one thing I do appreciate is the fact that she only has a one ponytail. Other, other figures make sure she has two, but... And like all figures, she does have 360 degree rotation at the elbow. It can move forward this much. It can almost go to a 90 degree bend here. She can pop her head up. And she should be able to stand. Stand, possibly. <laughs> yeah, she could sort of stand with her tail between her legs, but... Without it, without a stand. Let's see. Yep. She has this. She has absolutely nothing there. Uh, she has limited motion on one side due to her hair being in the way. You move her head off to the side. She does have 360 degree rotation in her arms. Up, down, right here. My Little Pony logo, and I'm pretty sure I haven't been showing any of that on screen. See, 360 degrees, just to make sure I do have it on screen. Same goes here. Same, the same as the right and the left, they're all the same. They move exactly the same way. She's just like, oh. She has the exact same motions as the rest. But she has some nice little cuffs accessories. I love the little gown in the back. And that's wonderful. Now let's put Applejack's hat back on because... <laughs> and knock the camera. Trying to do so. Alright, let's see. Uh, Looks like taking off the hat's a bad idea because it's difficult to get back on. Kind of just have to... Put on this ear and stretch it over the other ear and oh, there we go Whew that 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 was difficult I ended up knocking the camera around a few times. I apologize folks uh, Let's see let's See how we're gonna hmm. I think this uh, this here goes uh, Does it go around like this or you know what? Give me a second. Let me see how it uh, how it attaches to her. <laughs> uh, let's see if they have any pictures, any descriptions, a box. Mm. Nope, they have nothing on this. They have nothing, nothing. But if I'm not mistaken, this is a frontal bridle. Wraps around bridle right of of her should wrap around here, but it looks like it should be on a bigger character. Looks like it should wrap around in the front like so, but I don't know. This seems like it would be on a big character, a lot larger than her. I don't know. I don't know what it's for. It doesn't show it as a product placement on her. Maybe it goes to boil. Well, can't figure that one out. Move on to the sword. Now she's a swashbuckling pirate. Arg. Well, well, duh, she is a pirate, but she's after your apple booty. Yeah. Cha cha cha! 
Stubbity, stubbity, stub, stub, stub. <laughs> and that's Applejack. Uh, oh, it looks like her uh, neck piece here is uh, made out of light rubber. Next, uh, we'll try to attach the. Uh, it might be. Yep. If we kind of just put it on there, we've attached the nice little aerodactyl thing, which is kind of huge. If you don't have our head down, it just kind of just gets in the way. Uh, you know what? I think I might have that on backwards. Which doesn't make any sense anyway. No, I had it on right. It's just... It really is... It really is huge. And you could just make her fly like this, which... The hat really does get in the way, and this was not well thought out, was it? Hi, hey, we're funny. I'm flying. <laughs> See, Ray, my best. I can do it too. Might have a race. <laughs> yeah, it's a thing you can do. It doesn't work very well to me. Uh, it, it's really not what I would call a, an inventive source. It could have been something she could have wrote on it, like so, or... Maybe that might make more sense. If she was... Give me a second, folks. Every pony. Now that... That looks cool. Now that looks cool. <laughs> and maybe... Maybe I could incorporate that somehow by reaching around her neck and placing that... Make it so difficult to peg in. And if I just... Give me just a second, folks. I'm making her look cool for you. Well, cooler. And there we go. Now that's what I call epic. <laughs> a little heavy, but epically cool. Now that makes more sense to me. It is a d bit difficult to do, but it is a thing you can do. <laughs> and there we have Applejack riding her little rocket flying machine she's coming to take you you in the sky <laughs> all in all the set's pretty good I, I can't say I agree with every decision that's made with it like this thing this thing is just I still find that thing useless it's kind of pointless to be honest it's Something somebody would probably argued with about not being part of the whole statue get up, get up, but yeah, fun is something you can do. Uh, this does come off, and like I said, ball joints, etc. Same movements as every other, as all the other ponies. You're not gonna get any new surprises there. The hat is a bit difficult to get on and take off. But it's just a wonderful, wonderful set. I do enjoy it. It's, it have, I've had a lot of fun with it in the last few minutes. Just trying to get everything get everything sorted out. Because, well... It flaps. It flaps and spins. And yay. Honestly, this would have been better if it was a, you know, an electronic motor that just did it on its own. You know, just for about a 30 seconds. And cut off and you just had to start it again. But that's just my opinion about it. Now you could display this any way you like. I, I'm not sure how I'm going to display it, but it's your toy. Do whatever you like with it. 
$14.99 is how much it costs over at Walmart. And it is exclusive. There are two others and a, three others in a set of, set of Guardian of Harmony. Uh, two I'm going to have difficulties finding and getting a hold of. But as soon as I do, I will review them. And this has been No Pony Special. I hope you enjoyed the review. Like, comment, and subscribe uh, to my videos. If you like this video, please hit that thumbs up button. If you did not like it, still hit the thumbs up button. Button. And stay tuned for next time. We will have Boyle. Uh, supposedly a griffin, I think. A green one. A uh, new character introduced in the movie. I don't know. He looks like a griffin. I think he's a griffin, but he seems different somehow. Well, he's more of a giant par parrot person thing. I have no idea. You'll just have to see him. So stay tuned for next time.